Trelleborg Marine Systems is an industry-leading manufacturer of fendering systems, docking and mooring equipment, and offshore integrated mooring solutions. With a global reach and local presence, we're able to meet the most demanding project specifications on time and on budget, with bespoke solutions that best suit your project needs. Increasing vessel size, a broader variety of ships, and the prevalence of specialised projects are leading to ever more complex demands on port infrastructure. Port and terminal owners and operators, consultants and contractors are under pressure to accommodate these considerations whilst reducing downtime, improving accountability and above all, ensuring that marine environments are both safe and operationally efficient. To meet these conflicting demands, you need to make certain you've got the right solution for your project by ensuring your supplier provides a full service, end-to-end -end offering. We pride ourselves on our commitment to quality across our product range, all the way through to ensuring that the right support is in place after installation. But don't just take our word for it, we're going to show you the full process from design through to engineering, manufacturing, testing, installation, and finally, after sales maintenance and training, so that you can see exactly what goes into making certain you've got the high quality products that your project needs. Our team are engaged from the conceptual design stage, where we work on each project on a case-by-case -case basis to supply the most innovative, cost-effective solutions to suit even the most demanding applications. Because we produce fendering and docking and mooring equipment, as well as offshore integrated mooring solutions, we can provide you with a full service offering to meet the most challenging projects, or the spares or replacements you might require for smaller projects or ongoing maintenance needs. Our dedicated docking and mooring facility in Melbourne, Australia, has over 30 years experience providing the very best marine products to customers all over the world. Uh, I'm Henny William, uh, I'm one of the project leads at Trelleborg Marine Systems Melbourne. Um, our role basically is to interface with the clients on uh, several projects. Uh, we are the first line of contact, uh, if you like, with our clients. For each job gets a uh, team of, uh, uh, from uh, Trelleborg. Uh, the team consists of one project manager and uh, a mechanical engineer as well as an electrical engineer. Uh, they are assigned for the project specifically, but of course all the other internal uh, departments, they work uh, on the project as well. Our dedicated team will provide a tailored solution for your project, on time and on budget, wherever you are in the world. As well as a full suite of engineering and design programs, we have expert designers who are experienced in all industry-relevant CAD programs. The more detailed engineering design, modelling and analysis engineering for projects are sent to our Design Centre of Excellence in India for progression. Many of our competitors choose to outsource their engineering and manufacturing requirements, but as we are committed to complete cradle to grave services which, is, which we feel is essential in order to maintain quality right through the supply chain. So we are, we are having the in-house uh, engineering excellency so that we can deliver the right quality and the most economic design and engineering uh, products to our, to our clients. We are doing detailed engineering calculation and converting the calculated value into a real model using 3D softwares like SOLIDWORKS. Using 3D models, we can check the real-time errors and clashes if any, and also use fully in converting the calculated value in a final fabrication and production drawing, which ensure production and erection-friendly drawings. To ensure and check the manual calculations, we do finite element analysis using certain softwares. FEA analysis shows us the critical area, if any, wherein we can increase the strength by adding some material and also likewise we can remove some material from non-critical areas to make a rigid and optimized design. Having the engineering and design aspects of Trelleborg Marine Systems centralized in this way, 
enables Trellebook to drive cost efficiency and improves collaboration to enable cross-fertilization of ideas across their global offices. Here in Melbourne, Australia, a Morin and Docking facility has an area of over 1,500 square metres for manufacturing and testing. This gives us the capacity to accommodate multiple large-scale Morin and Docking projects at any given time. For a typical jetty-based project, the hook base arrives after comprehensive third-party non-destructive testing and painting at a local facility. The required instrumentation and control equipment, which has been manufactured in-house and tested prior to assembly, is now ready to be installed on the base. In the final stages, the capstans are installed and temporary power and control cables are connected for full factory integrated testing. Our engineers personally oversee and sign off on all testing procedures. Our strategically located state-of-the-art factories and offices enable our global industry-leading manufacturing capacity. Our fendering products are also manufactured in-house to ensure we have full control over the design and quality of everything we produce. Here is the manufacturing facility in Qingdao. We are manufacturing all different types of fenders, ranging from 300 mm to 3 meters tall. We have a team of more than 100 employees working around the clock, making sure that we are manufacturing fenders to the highest quality and provide stringent testing on all our products. Fenders are made using natural and synthetic rubbers, carbon black and other ingredients. The compound is blended to stringent guidelines and all our fenders comply with the guidelines set out in Pienck's 2002 Guidelines for the Design of Fender Systems, as well as our own internal guidelines. The ingredients are exposed to high temperatures to come to their melting point and the raw rubber compound is created. Steel inserts are cut to shape, ready to be vulcanised into the base and head of the fenders. This allows easy attachment to a steel or high-performance polyethylene panel. Once cut, the inserts are shot blasted and primed, ready for use. A layer of adhesive is applied and a layer of rubber is rolled onto the steel. The steel insert is then ready to be added to the rubber moulds. Again, all our fender moulds are developed in-house to ensure we can control consistency in the design and quality of our products. Here, the mould is being filled to capacity with strips of high-quality, pre-tested rubber. Once full, it is sealed and put into a vulcanising press, which heats up the rubber and compresses it to the desired shape. In this example, an element fender is produced. Now it just needs the excess rubber trimming off. This is the extrusion process, which vulcanises the rubber as it passes through a heated die. It is then simply cut to the specified size. In this example, an M fender has been produced. Dimensional inspections are conducted, and if the fender is perfectly to specification, it will be signed off. Our steel fender panels are produced to our strict specifications by a trusted partner. Again, before we use their materials in any way, they are fully quality checked. Panels above 25mm in thickness will undergo ultrasonic testing to ensure there are no internal flaws. Once the materials are fully tested and approved for use, the steel plates or other steel sections are clearly marked and cut to specification. The next step in the process is to weld together the required parts. Pressure testing is carried out and all surfaces, joints and welds rigorously checked for defects. The steel panels are then ready to be coated in an environmentally friendly compound, specially formulated to withstand the marine environment. 
Once dry, the high-performance polyethylene panels are bolted to the steel and the finished products are ready to be sent to the customer. Some fenders require accessories such as bolts, shackles and chains, which we procure from a pre-approved, reputable supplier and are manufactured using the highest quality steel to produce the best quality products. We welcome customers to visit our facility to witness testing of their valued equipment. Regardless, it is Trailball's commitment to ensure that all equipment leaving our facility has undergone extensive testing, making for smooth and timely commissioning. Some of the testing procedures trailer bog fenders go through are quality control test of raw materials, rubber compound testing, for instance, specific gravity, tensile strength, elongation at break, ozone resistance, aging resistance, and all other properties given in our catalog. We also do full-scale fender testing, including vertical compression, angular compression, and 3000 cycle durability testing. Our docking and mooring equipment is also tested to the highest standards. Right, after the manufacturing process being complete, we then go through a testing procedure, which has been put in by Trolleyborg. Uh, it's called a test record sheet. And what this does then is we test the, the motor starter enclosure, or commonly known as the DOL. And we also test the capstan for operation and for duty cycle. Once our products are thoroughly tested and approved, they are ready to be shipped to the customer. We make certain at this stage in the process that they are properly packaged and ready for installation. It takes time to make certain when supplying bespoke solutions and integrated full service solutions. And sometimes a project needs a quicker turnaround. To ensure we can truly offer an end-to-end -end service, we also offer a fender rental service on our foam and pneumatic fenders to ensure a fast delivery on these products for temporary applications with shorter timescales. A typical maintenance package would involve two visits to site per year by a Trellborg trained engineer. And this engineer would perform the routine service tasks as well as provide a report which will allow the clients to see forward in terms of maintenance planning and maintenance needs. We can also offer further options of defined response times, operational spare parts requirements, or anything else the client may feel they need. Basically, the client just needs to sit down with us and talk about what they want to do, and we'll put together a custom option to fit their needs. Besides maintenance programs, Trolloborg are also able to offer full product training for equipment once it has been installed, particularly on the more complex integrated docking and mooring systems that we supply. For example, on the Isle of Grain LNG import terminal in the UK, Trolloborg recently provided full training to the terminal operators for the docking and mooring systems that we supplied. The client was so pleased with the after-sales support received from Trelleborg that they are now planning further upgrades to the terminal and its equipment, which will include additional operator training by Trelleborg. Basically what we're looking to provide is technical, maintenance and operational training so the clients can fully understand and get the most out of our equipment. It's often well considered that training is required as part of equipment handover, but it's important too to consider that after two or three years, due to operational staffing changes. The training might be something you want to address on an ongoing basis. And we're there to help when you need us. From the conceptual design stage, to testing, to installation and beyond, we're committed to providing end-to-end, -end, full service solutions for even the most demanding marine environments around the globe. Make certain that your project is supplied with bespoke, high quality solutions, on time and on budget, wherever you are in the world. Make certain with Trelleborg Marine Systems.